I'm still pinching myself, you know. It's, uh, one, it's been a fantastic night, but uh, look, just growing up, as I said, and, 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 and idolising Port Adelaide Football Club, idolising players like Russell Ebert and Brian Cunningham, all those guys, and, and uh, you know, growing up and, and, and dreaming that I could play for Port Adelaide Footy Club, and then to play for them, and then to play premierships, and now to be inducted in the Hall of Fame, it's just a dream, a dream come true. I can't believe uh, how I'm feeling tonight. I'm just, I'm an emotional roller coaster. I'm, I'm proud, I'm, I'm happy, I'm, I'm thinking, what the hell am I doing here? I, I don't feel worthy. So it's just amazing uh, the emotional roller coaster you go through. Especially when you look at the greats in the room that are in the Hall of Fame, you go, wow, how did this happen to me? I've got to say, as a kid growing up, you know, I idolised, I followed Port Adelaide, and we heard commentators saying things like, the Port Adelaide Football Club, when the player puts on the Guernsey, he turns superhuman, you know, and he grows a third leg, he, he does all these amazing things. And I'll never forget when I pulled that Port Adelaide footy Guernsey on, I looked in the mirror and go, oh shit, I'm in trouble, I'm not superhuman. But then I ran out the ground and I've gone, oh, I get it, it's the supporters, they're the ones, their expectations are up here, they expect you to win every week. Now the first time I walked in the club, they told me, an average year for the Port Alley Football Club over the 125 years, what it was back then, was to play off in the grand final. So that was an average year for the Port Alley Footy Club. So expectations were always high. And uh, you know what? I didn't shy away from it. I go, great. And we were able to maintain that and improve that. So to me and, and the team that I, the teams that I played with, it's just credit to them because you know it's it's a it's a team game. It's all about you know, being part of that team. But the community, they're still around. They're hard. They're hard. They, they have high expectations and so they should um, and you know, I'm sure we'll be successful again in the future.